looks and clarity. I must do what I must do from the bottom of my heart. We are coming up to the what is the end of 12 is it 12 2000 listening to the pipes listening to the pipes at 20 seconds 2010 to 2011 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 coming up to what is a completion of 12 years of Mr. Tackpan's out to lunch, a little embarrassed, a little scared over the years to where we going into our 13th year, but not in our 13th year. We will be beginning what is the age of man into the 157th moon, male and female in one moon. A combined male and female reducing from what was Taurus into the unicorn of Mars what is the ring into a pole what is 14 or NA into a PG parental guidance 13 and over one five and seven the reason for all of these as well as male and female is because phobus and demas the moons of mars and lunas the moons of earth equaling to the outside and all around the funnel coming down into one um, area now the question is is it an oil can funnel where the point is in the center or is it straight up where the funnel runs down this way into a duct going straight down going from one side over to the other in the construct of the matrix. The matrix being hacked, can we look at it that way? Looking at the white rabbit, looking at one red sun. Why are we looking at one red sun? O-N-E-N-E-O. Neo, one red sun DNA, Anderson, A N D D N A, D E R R E D S O N, Nos, meaning our sun, also spelled S O N. And if you would say us, you would actually be saying the French word of new and not saying who you are as to vu. New, not saying I, but saying us. In the word spelt new in French, it is not any W555 reverse 222 times 8 equaling to 1776. So it would only be 1 times um, 555. 555, five, 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 222 times 8 is 1776. And actually, that would be 7 and 1. Remember, you come out door number 7 and you go in to door number 7. Uh, just give me one second here. Isn't that what it's all about? Interrupted by the buzz of a phone. That's why I usually shut everything off. Lost my mind. For those who don't see what this is, and you see it this way, this can be Snoopy, but this is half of a spade. This is what half a spade looks like. All right? So we can almost say it's like a strawberry. I'm not sure. Can it look like a duck going this way? or a bird or a Snoopy dog, like on that side, something like that. It can also maybe look like the, uh, not sure, number two, maybe a bird that flew in over here. Not too sure. Um, so let me see what I was going to think of. I was um, not sure where I am right now, a little bit lost. I was gonna do a live video, just hurt myself. Um, for me, it's very bad because um, who wants to get hurt? Look like Santa Claus, right? So we were talking, right, we were talking about the moons. So we have the two moons of Mars, very important. One and two is very important. Another thing that's important 
is also all the numbers because they all say something. So I bring the revelation into where um, one, one and two, and then two and four. One and two is the base, okay? And then it becomes two and four, and then it becomes four and eight, and then it becomes eight and seven, and then it becomes seven and five. It's a rotation of numbers. I'm gonna show you how this rotation works right now. Where we use it, we can use it anywhere. It's, um, how can I say it? It's like a system, like a metric system to see where numbers match up in different um, calculating. And when you double things up, you know everything else is in between. It's, it's that simple. Uh, so, um, and another thing is one and two. Um, actually, it's four times two. Um, what happens is on, on a dice cube, right, we have the singular area over here. And then we have the other cube, right, which is... Uh, right, it's basically over here. And see, I, I don't, I should just not go fast. So what's happening is you have a one-set pair there, and then you have a two-set pair there. Oh, sorry, uh, you have a two-set pair here, and then you have a three-set pair here, and then you have a four-set pair here. So what you're looking at, okay, is one, one, two, two, four, four three, three. This is what you're looking at right here. This is the basic uh, structure um, of our numbers. It is A, B, C, D equals to 10. Now, nothing, that when I understand things, I like to do it in this way, nothing is ever more than three times. So I'm going to show you something over here. Let's see, whoop, I just lost it on the screen. I'm going to show you this piece over here. Okay, now what's going on here is, you see this area here, right? Well, what happened is that is... Yeah, so I'm going to end the video. I was uh, gone uh, for a bit, and I don't remember exactly what I was talking about, which is not very professional. I have to figure out how to get the screen smaller. And um, so I was looking at this. There's two images here. There's this one here. And then there's this one here. And where this actually comes from is this is the Tesla. This would be, um, if I remember correctly, um, 2, um, 5, and 8. And then there's another one for 1, 4, and 7. All I did was flip these around, right? When you flip them around. Now, hold on a second. I got some noise in the background, so I like to uh, stop that noise in the background. One second. Okay. Yes, yeah, so basically, so now what I want to do next is I want to cut these out. I'm going to print them and then put three of them together to see the um, what I should get as the hexagon uh, from it. But you can see that with inside the four, I have created the hexagon. Now, did I do this on purpose? Well, what I want to show you right now is let's see if we can do this is in creating this shape right in creating these shapes this piece comes out so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to just want just one second okay and i just want to show you so that's what comes out of it when you draw up the Tesla, I don't know if I have a cat outside or something. Just give me a second. So I want to get back to uh, what this is. This is from the vortex of Tesla. And I'm trying to um, look where that piece um, is. Okay, so here's that vortex. Hold on. Oh, yeah, this computer. I got to go bring it in. Okay, so this, if you see the, the green, so I, you see the way it connects? One, four, and seven, right over here. Now, we're going to rotate, rot, 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 rotate it to the right, and then it's going to be, well, this shows uh, this. I think I did it on a little bit off. It's got to be turned a little bit. But you get the drift of what I'm doing, right? Then what I want to do is 
print these. I'm going to have to go ahead and um, hold on a second. Copy, paste, and you know what these three are, right? These three here. I'm going to show you what these are. These are, um, whoop, you just take one of these, and this is, um, let me see. Let me see when I make it bigger. Yeah, that one belongs to 2, 5, and 8. This one over here belongs to 2, 5, and 8. And then we can go and check this one out. And we're going to go see. And this one here, see this blue one here? Actually, I'm going to color it in just to show you something different. Uh, maybe make it uh, purple. Okay, I'm just going to color it purple. And... Uh, I mean, I can just carry it like this. And then when I bring that in, if you take a look where the purple one is, you see the purple one? Whoop. See the purple one moving? See the way it's on number one here? The way it's on number four here? So the purple one is two, four, and seven. So these images you were just looking at, these three images, they're actually coming from this. So what you see is Tesla's setup. I also see as the setup on this calculator and I also understand it related to the dice cube and I also understand it related to the Rubik's cube but um, let me move on another thing is when you write the um, small l it looks like this next to the capital E so it looks like an IE very mysterious the L is the 12th letter to the I as the ninth letter where Alpha Beta came in to create what is I, to where I holds creation, and now it recreates going from 12, okay, over to 21. And if you know, there's nine. But in the nine, there's eight. So what happened to 10 and 11? A, B, C, D, E, F, 11 and 10, window, 88 um, so another thing I want to speak about with this just just blatant 90 plus 11 remember 101 um, and 90 plus 9 this is going to the other side of 99 99 0 99 so you're actually going 0 99 99 and we're counting down 98 90 what creates 81, what creates 89, what creates 72 and 17, what creates 14 and 09, what creates 08 and 07. This is the countdown of 99. 9 times 9, 9 plus 9, 18 and 81. 1 times 8, 1 plus 8, and now we have two systems going, and it goes both ways. Do we run into 86? It all depends the way you want to put this mathematical situation together. There's eight numbers. There's 13 through 20, exactly the way the Mayan have it set up. The difference is seven. Uh, there's other situations that this fits into, um, the same as the, um, the I. I think they call it the I of Horus, which is six, seven, and six. Okay, And what is connected to six besides what is seven is five. 7 come 11, 13 come 5, meaning here comes the sun, the gateway, and the student. 11 is the student, creation of the light. I don't know why they call it GHT, and now it's the life. Instead of the light, L-I-G-H-T, it becomes the life. And please note that this is an F sound. These two together create 6, as like this. This letter is a gateway, and it is actually 5D. Five, um, five uh, one of the reasons for this is 5 is E, and 5 times D equals to 20. And what happens, um, I'm going to try and see if I can get myself out of this little hole that I'm in to try and explain it, is that in French, um, in order to get 20, you have to go 4 times, five, uh, four times uh, 20. In, in order to get um, 80, 
Uh, so I say you need five times four in order to get 20. Um, it all works between one and five and between one and between five and between one and between five. And the Roman numerals are like M, D, C, um, L, um, uh, X, uh, V, and then and then one or uh, and then one. Uh, the other thing I wanted to mention, um, where where is this? Um, stop the gate, uh, boy, 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 boy. Wow. Seventh month, fourth day, Hebrew, October, September, October, and Tishrei, seventh month, the New Year's for the Hebrews. Um, this is funny. This is the 10 cent piece. This looks like a crown to outline the crown. This is what you must do to close the sides of the crown. You must have 77 and that is matter. That is Christ to connect them together. You must have the Roman numeral V in what creates 757 that connecting 66 gate as you climb the ladder in Gematria of 757 gateway moon. Oh, here it is. This is what I wanted to say. The greatest Roman numeral that I know, okay, then basic in school is 1000, which is 10 C and D is 500, which is 5 C. You put them together also known as 44. And this one's also noted as DC M is number 13. This is zero four. So in M is DC. They're both in the four house, the difference between day and night. This is 10 times C, this is five times C. C is a value of 100. Five times 100 is 500. 10 times 100 is 1000. This is the house creation of C11. C11 goes from what is um, K, okay? Or if you wanna go AA, like in the house of Kaba, right? Because it goes K, which is the 11th letter, which is also known as ace 11 in blackjack, that when you remove the ace of being valued in one suit as 10 and count it as 11, it equals to 101, which is valued at 1, 0, uh, 1, 2, and 4. So 10, 4, that is your communication in your birth. This stands for rotation, and it is the month of January when F, the student, comes into the house. Because what is one and one? The reverse is 66. Uh, what is one and one? One and one will recreate one and two by the multiplication of one times one, uh, one plus one. This is Roman numeral, okay? 100, 100% of something equals to actually one. 10, 1,000 is 10%. So we're getting, so no, it means 10 times. 1,000 equals to 10 times. So if we get 10 times one whole, which is 100% C, and this is 500, which is five times 100% C, so it's five times the value of C. But is whole 1,000 because 10 times 10 times 10 equals to 1,000 equaling to a whole, in which what you have to understand is you're crisscrossing on the cube, and I must have did this three times this week, is when we crisscross on the cube, what we're going to do is we're going to go 1 and 9, we're going to go 2 and 8, and we're going to go 4 and 6. And then we're going to go 1 and 2, and then we're going to go, um, sorry, 1 and 9, and 3 and 7, and then we're going to go 2 and 8. So here we have a 30, here we have a 30, and you notice we have different stars, and we have different connections if we want to start connecting it if we're connecting this one down this way the other one we're going to connect is going to be this way for balance uh, when it comes to this um, if i'm going to do this this way i'm going to do this that way and then i can keep reversing it so these are my 30s okay there's more ways to do this one. So we're gonna carry on more 30. So what I'm gonna do is instead of you watching me here, I'm going to uh, take a little break. I'm gonna do them all up and I'm gonna come back and show them to you. And uh, I hope you're enjoying this video. I am uh, on the spot learning myself. So what you see many times is the same thing that I see as, um, you know, when you're learning, you're learning. If that's what I believe and that's what I see. I'm going to show you more about the 30s 
and then I'm going to explain to you what the 40s is. But before I go, I'll explain to you what the 40s is. The 40s is all the combinations, all the tens. And what we also have to come back to think about ourselves, think about is what happens about the five position, the center position. And that center position, the center over here, you can't, when you're moving this side, you're not moving the center. When you're moving this side, you're not moving the center. When you're moving the top and the bottom. So there's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hold on a second. One, two, three, four. Four, what is it? Six. Move this one and move this one is two. Move this one and move this one is four. This way and this way is two. This way and this way is four. So I think there's four ways uh, that you don't disturb the center. And um, that I have to design and show you something. I'm going to come back. Okay, what's going to happen is first I'm going to show you these squares. First there's one square. Then there are four squares. First, there's one dot, okay? Then there are two dots, but it looked like there used to be one in the center, so there's three dots, four dots, five dots. But in creating those five dots, okay, I'm only going to create the four squares. In the one dot, I'm going to create four dots. So this gets four dots. This gets nine dots. This gets four squares. Okay. And one center. Four and one. This is the Mars area. Right. This one over here with the four dot one square. Can we call it this? The, uh, the stripes and the solids, I don't know. So with that said, so once that's done, which is the Earth mo module, okay, you end up with four dots. And then from the four dots, you end up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So it becomes four, four, two, and four in dots. I know it's really confusing. I don't know where it brings the end result. Uh, but these are the situations, okay? Now what's going to happen is I'm going to create, um, where is my first one? I am going to create a four area, one, two, three, four. And from that, here's my four area. And this is the minimum, okay? Um, this is the uh, minimum what can, um, dimension that I can create. When I draw one more area over when I draw one more area over this, okay, I'm going to end up with two empty spots. Almost as if you take a look at the dice and you begin to understand what the two empty spots of Venus are. So you're always going to be using up. And in each situation, when you're overlapping, you're either going to be leaving over a Mars 4 area, an Earth 9 area, a Venus single digit dot earth area on the inside um, I don't know what they all mean I'm just trying to I just you know I've done this before but I'm looking at it again okay this one's gonna be ho 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 uh, the reason uh, for this and to come up with the 15 ball 5 times 3 5 plus 3 okay um, 5 times 3 is 15 5 plus 3 is 8 and uh, do I have it is this where the core there's four here and four here in the core I don't know if I want to do that I'm gonna leave that out Here's 818 Venus overlapping a 9 area, leaving overlapping it in the corner. This is the 9 corner for birth, leaving 818, which is 9 times 9, 9 plus 9, okay, equals to 1881. This is the heaven's birth. If this was our alphabet, you can see where the ninth one is participating right over here. 1, 5, and 9 end up participating over there, although the actual 5 on a cube was over here and over here and now the five ends up over here so in your total cube okay of what is 18 and 8 number 26 which is h 
and R, let's say home run or har or ashar, uh, something to do with God. And I'm going to just fill this in and see if it creates C and C. What does it create when we fill this in? You know, this is art by numbers. There's a story to it in creation. Uh, what does it create? What are these three things? Is it Canadians hockey? Do I have to create this bigger? There's another dimension uh, to this. I'm just trying to see um, how can I fill that dimension in? Uh, should I be looking this way? I'm not sure which way I should be actually looking at this. Um, can I actually see um, like this? I'm not really sure what I should be doing with this. I'm just I'm just thinking. I'm just trying to see what I can do. Anyways, to jump off that, I'm not happy I did that. Here is where the 9 and 9 is 18. And I overlapped it by two areas. In this one, I only overlapped the single area. Leak will lead to 818 Venus. Here comes the sun. You can see in the Venus house, there are four areas of Venus. But you can only create three. One and 9, 10. Okay. And over here is going to be um, uh, 3 and 7, 10. Across from here, it's 4 and 6, 10. Unless I turn it this way, it's 2 and 8, 10. So you can get 30, 60, and you're crossing 10s. Crossing through the one area here. So that's 60. So we're going to work on all these um, designs over here. So uh, just to start with, just to show you that... Um, that I can create from here. This upper line, I'm going to remove it. What that when that upper line comes in, in fact, this whole thing comes in because it's what it's doing with these numbers here. And I'm going to show you. Here is you see, I need to do one, two, three. It's got to be four so I can find the center, right? And um, we're going to um, uh, do another one. It's going to be um, right over here. So this is going to be one and 9, and 2, and 8, and 4, and 6. And we already did that, right? And you can see that this pole, and these are turning around. The 2, 4, 6, and 8 is turning around pole for 1 and 9. Remember, there's two worlds. There's the heavens creation, okay, and that we live in, which comes from a different cyclone. Um, we're in one world, and the heaven is another world that creates us. We're in its heaven, in our heaven, and in our bodies, if you can... Uh, follow that and so in this one I went down here and I went up here um, Okay, so let me do this here. I went up here now What I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and go down here see the way we have the same numbers But in this one I tilted to the left this I tilt to the right 1289 um, So now we're going to do it again. I can do this again and um we're going to do this again. I'm not going to do them all. I'm a little tired. Uh, sorry about that. So we're going to go 2 and 8 and 4 and 6 and um, 1 and 9. So we did this one and this one. Um, we did this one and that one. Um, did we do this one? Uh, I did. No, I did this one. I did this one. See, I can't do that one. You know why? The gap is too great. I can close... A 45 degree angle is the fox pass in the sun but I can't if I wanted to close here I can't close here right what would happen if I close here right the only thing I can I can do with this is uh, cube it like that and then turn it into that corner right and then I can I can't if I do it here the cube gets split so if I do it over here uh, let me see how did how did this do it I did this, I did this, and I did this, right? See the way it looks like a long corridor? If I would be doing this, we'd end up with a long corridor here. And then I would be drawing the lock down over here. But I didn't want to do it that way. I think I came out. Did I come out too far? Did I come out too far? Anyways, you, you see what I'm getting at, right? So there's one here and there's one here. So there's 30 and there's 60. And then in this one, 
over here. Um, did I get that right? Yeah, okay, so I got that right. And then we did it this way with three and seven. So now I did that one. So now I'm gonna do uh, this one over here. So this becomes seven four, which is energy Jesus of time. And then you're gonna lock it in uh, with this over here. So you're gonna get 30 and 30 and 30 and 30. Now the thing is, when you're connecting, you're only connecting 20 and 20 and 20. So you have 90, but you only get 60. 30, 30, 30. You only get 60. In your next 90, 30 times 4 equals to 90. Okay, you're only going to end up with 20, 40, 60. Um, hold on a second. I did that wrong. 4 times 30 equals to 120. And you're going to have 4 times 20 equaling to 80. Um, 6 times 2, 6 plus 2, which is the game house that we are in, 420s, equaling to what is creation. And when you lower it to the primary cycle, this becomes 60 and 90. The fourth flip is the one that duplicates. So we have this one and this one, or we reversed it, and this one and this one. Our next one that we're going to run into is uh, here and here and here. And this is 2, 8 again, and this is um, 3, 7, 1, 9. And the next one, uh, so in that one, we're going to, whoop, you see we can't do it on the same side. See what happens? I did it on the same side. Uh, I have to do it this way. Okay, here's my 1289. Did I get this one done here? This is my 3, 7 running in, I didn't run the 3, 7, I ran the 2, 8, I ran the, 8, 9. Did I run the 8, 9? I ran the 8, 9. I ran the 8, 2. But I didn't run it this way. So wait a second. I have... But I didn't run this way. Do you, do you see what I'm doing? I didn't run this way. I ran three lines. 10. These are the connecting. This is the hourglass 1289. Here's the hourglass 1289. But it's 1289 with 46. Here it's 1289 with 37. So now I'm going to do it again. And, whoop, that's not what I wanted. Um, hold on a second. So this is the 9, the 1, the 2, the 3, uh, the 7, the 8, and the 1. So now I did this side, so now I'm going to do that side. So here I got 2378, and I'm crisscrossing 1 and 9 open up. So I still have an open area over here, but that's okay, because our Venus area in this cycle is 1 and 9. You see this way, and then this way, they're different, right? Here, the creation cycle, here's that birth cycle pull. So now you have 20 and 30 here, 20 and 30 here, where you crisscross them. Are there any more? Are there any more? Oh, yes, I'm going with this straight line here. So now I'm going to go with this line here, and this line here, and this line here, and this line here. And this is one, three, four, six, seven, nine. So what's going to happen here is I'm going to, did I go connect one, four? I'm going to connect one, four over here, and then I'm going to connect the six, nine over here. Then I'm going to connect the seven, four. Um, with the 3, 6, and this is going to be 4, 7. So let's see if we have that anywhere. 4 and 6 across, 4 and 6 across, 4 and 6 across, 4 and 6 across, 1 and 4 connected. No, I stopped this one. I took it off. I did a different one. Uh, the connection was here. Oh, no, no, no. One second. No, 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 no. Okay, so here is number two, four, one. So when we look at this one, 
right? We're crisscrossing 1379, and here I'm not crisscrossing 1379. My three lungs are my three lines are four and six, four and six. I don't have the two and eight as I have the two and eight over here. So in here I have the four and six. So I have, and if you take a look, if you want to take a, a look, it becomes 365 days, 0.47, right? But we don't have the crossing. We don't have this crossing in here. We have them all separate. Here, they crisscross them together. Here, they did not. Inside of here is where AI comes in. See the 36547 energy and time? So we are going to get... We are going to get what we got up here is four, and down here we got four. So the complete cycle is four times 30 equals to 120, four times 20 equals to 80, and then it happens again, four times 30 equals to 120, and four times 20 equals to 080, and this one equals to 200, this one equals to 200. If I was minusing the 80, it would equal to 40. 40 low, 120 high tells me about the purple skies. Purple 88 window. A, B, C, D, 10. E, F, um, 11. G, 7. Total 28. We're going to come down over here. Uh, so we did this one, this one, this one, that one, and that one. I'm not going to go through much of the numbers. Purple Pegasus house and this one over here. When you overlap a 4x4 four four house, 16 by 16 an equivalent of, I'm going to look at it as day and night, what ends up happening, you end up with a 12 area, or 3 fours, and then 1 4, and 3 fours. The house of DC, the purple house, house of Pegasus. Um, George. Branch. One and one. One and one. One times one, one plus one. The cycle. What happens? I'm, I'm a little lost here. But yes, this, this, I think it's this one over here. Um, no, this will bring us to here. This end result of this will end up over here. will end up over here. Let me show you. Let me show you. 1 times 1, 1 plus 1 is 1 and 2. 1 times 2, 1 plus 2 is 2 and 3. 2 times 3, 2 plus 3 is 6 and 5. 6 times 5, 6 plus 5 is 4 and 1. 4 times 1, 4 plus 1 is 5 and 4. 5 times 4, 5 plus 4 is 20 and 9, 29. 2 times 9, 18. 2 plus 9, 11. So your birth brings us to this cycle, 11 and 18. This will end up bringing you over here, making it KS. This will end up uh, bringing you to uh, this uh, and these two numeric values over here, which will be 7 and 14, 8 and 9, W-O. Um, win a big red high sun. And I'm tired. And I'm going to come back another day and do a little bit more so I can get some kind of rhythm going. I'm on a Raphael 7286 in a constellation of Pegasus. These pieces of design come from this. Thank you for watching this video. Oh, and then it does, and then it does all kinds of stuff. Let me see if I can just find something before I go. And then it does this because I, just want to, I have to just show you that one piece. It's not here. Hold on. Yeah, it's right here. Where I see this piece here, it's right here. And that's Tesla's um, design. And just inside, when you back all those pieces up, boom. So I'm going to print this out and see if I can bring three of these together. Thank you for watching this video.